What is up guys, it's NNW Jacob Montaigne here. Um, I'm going to be doing a unboxing review of a package I had just finished uh, receiving. So um, without further ado, I'm going to cut open the box. Um, it's a pretty big box, I got it here on my lap. I'm not going to show the top because that's where the address labels are. I don't want to give out any personal information, but it's a pretty big box. So it's heavy. Uh, the shipping was $19 to let you get an idea. So, without further ado, I'm going to start cutting open the box here. And we can see how my stuff arrived. Uh, a lot of newspaper. Other forms of packaging, had some grocery bags, etc. Let me just set all this newspaper back. Okay. And starting off here, let me get some of these cleaned up a little. Um, I am beginning to start work on a better freight train, so a lot of these parts will need small repairs, wheels, couplers, etc. But um, as you can see, this one needs a coupler and a wheel, but I got this new hopper car. And then I got this hopper car, it's ready to go. Uh, both have couplers and wheels, so that's good. It rolls pretty nice. I'll put some lubricant on there. But there's that one. So we've got two of those. Set them sideways here, so I can do a big shot of them at the end. Um, uh, I got another one here. Looks like a piece of it got broken during transport but it just needs a coupler um, it's got all the wheels you can see there it's got a broken piece of plastic so I'll see if I can, might be able to fix that but I got that one um, this one again needs uh, some couplers on one end and uh, repair box on the other end but and it needs a brake wheel but there's this one uh, it's missing a few tabs um, might be able to patch that up and fix it up a little bit uh, next up we have this car which is missing some so, I'm going to have to try to fix that. I'll hold off on that one. Um, I got this N&W coal car here. That's pretty nice. Um, I got this nice Wabash double door box car. Um, needs couplers on both ends. But the coupler boxes are complete, so all I have to do is put couplers in there. Um, so that's pretty nice. Uh, the doors do open. So that's good. And uh, the roof's missing on this one for some reason, but there's that one. Uh, ready to go. It's got couplers and wheels. Um, well, how in the heck did that little pack of peanut get in there? Sorry, you give me one second. Get this removed. Alrighty. So, um, this one needs both couplers and a wheel back there, as you can see, but... Overall, the car's in 
pretty decent condition. Uh, this one needs a brake wheel as well. Um, moving on here, this one needs a coupler and a wheel as well. Needs a coupler on this end and a wheel down here. But just another hopper there. And, uh, this one just needs a coupler and she'll be ready to go. Uh, it's another covered hopper. I got a lot of covered hoppers in this trade. But, um, as you can see, there's that. It's got one coupler on that end. I'll need to fix the other on. And, uh, got a few more in here. But, there's that one. Um, this one needs two couplers, but besides that, everything else is in decent condition. Got a, another N and W here. Um, this one's in pretty decent condition. It needs a brake wheel as well. Move some of these packing peanuts I got crammed in here. But I got this nice N and W. Hopper here. A coupler box just fell off, so I'll have to fix that. I'll set that over here. But um, N and W hopper needs two couplers. All the wheels are there though. This one looks fairly new. That's nice. Move some more of this packaging. Uh, I can see there's a few wheels in the bottom of the box, um, so that's good. Uh, that means that I'm not gonna have to do too much replacing on stuff. Um, let's see if I can get these out. Quite a few wheels under here. Move some of this bubble wrap that got popped in transport. <clears throat> This one's in pretty rough shape. Just bear with me one second. Let me uh, attempt to get this thing somewhat reassembled. This one's definitely got to have some work done to it. Oh, that was really rough. This was not packaged very well at all. There is a lot of broken stuff on this one. Definitely going to spend a lot of time repairing this, but right there is another hopper that I got. Uh, the roof and all that stuff just smashed to pieces. Uh, you know, your basic stuff that you can expect with UPS priority, USPS priority. Um, Looking in here, I got another one smashed to pieces. I have to do some repairs on that. <clears throat> um, got this NNW box car. So, that's somewhat of a high. Uh, I believe I have two of these now, I'm not really for sure. Uh, I think this is my only one. I do believe I traded the other one a while back. But couplers and all that. It's missing a wheel, but I have some spare ones. So I got that. And uh, this Wabash box car. Um, this one's metal. So that's pretty nice. Um, overall, the box car looks really nice, but it definitely needs some work. As you can see there, one of the trucks broke. So, got a lot of projects I'm going to be working on now. Then, um, I got 
this box car. It's not really one I asked for, but yeah, got this little guy here. Uh, going by the way this looks, you would assume that the roof hatches would open, but I do not believe they do. So yeah, um, that one, that one's ready to go. Um, I was supposed to get more, uh, good thing I haven't sent mine yet. I'm going to have to contact the guy, but um, I got several of these Wabash um, reefer cars, so there's one, there's two, and here's three, and um, let me just try to get all these parts out of here, because I'm going to have to work all day on trying to get these parts back on which is not shipped very well at all there's a lot of broken pieces in here a lot of broken pieces um, kind of a shame he told me he was gonna ship them very well um, the bubble wrap, I'm guessing, was clearly used and really old because that stuff was just busted up. Uh, the bubble wrap was popped. It was just like putting saran wrap around an expensive locomotive and shipping it as is and hoping that nothing's going to break. Um, let me see here. There's the piece of the truck that broke from the Wabash car. This thing's just full of a whole bunch of little broken pieces. So it'll take a while to go through all that. But yep, that's what I got. Kind of a disappointment. Um, I'm missing quite a few things that we agreed on. So yeah. Um, on the high though, there's my southern that I got. That was what I was mainly looking forward to the southern box car so I got that and I think this one's the Wabash one yep the Wabash one that's unbuilt so um, I'm about five or six cars short from what we agreed on and there's just a small fraction of what's in the bottom of the box right now broken wise but there's all my new cars traded for uh, a few locomotives, a lumber yard, and a Atlas Caboose. Um, that's definitely going to be renegotiated now, renegotiated, because um, yeah, these were a lot better whenever we talked. So uh, I'm not going to drag y'all guys into the personal fraction of it, but there's my new stuff. Um, a lot of new projects, but should be there in no time, hopefully. But until then, y'all guys don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will talk to y'all guys later.